Hello friends, this video straight line part 5 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched straight lines part 1 to part 4. Now let's understand various forms of equation of a line. There are various forms, horizontal and vertical lines, point slope form, two point form, slope intercept form, intercept form and normal form. These are the various forms of equations of line. So that means we can write any equation, any line in these forms. We'll, we'll go through all this thing in the next slides. Now horizontal and vertical line. So any line which is parallel to x-axis or y-axis, they are horizontal and vertical lines. So this line which is parallel to x-axis, it is horizontal lines and the line which is parallel to y axis is called vertical lines so this is vertical lines this is horizontal lines so when you see horizontal lines that means it is parallel to x axis so it maintains a common distance from x axis so you see y is equal to some constant so here y is equal to a so we get a line that is parallel to x axis at a direction at the distance of a from x axis. When you see y is equal to minus a, again you get a line, horizontal line parallel to x axis at a distance of minus a from x axis. In case of vertical lines, it maintains a constant distance from y axis. So you see x is equal to b for example. So this is a vertical line which is b distance from y axis. And when you say x equal to minus b, you get this line, which is minus b distance from y axis. So horizontal lines are parallel to x axis, and the equation is of this form: y is equal to a, or y is equal to minus a, that is y is equal to k. Vertical lines are parallel to y axis, and the equation is x is equal to a, or x equal to b, or x equal to some constant. Please note: horizontal line parallel to x axis. Equation on the form y is equal to k. Vertical lines parallel to y axis. Equation of the form x is equal to k. We'll take some example of horizontal lines. So we have to find the equation of lines parallel to x axis or axis passing through 2, 4. Let's take this x, y coordinate axis and here we have 2, 4. This is the point. Now we have to draw parallel lines. Are parallel to the x's. So let's draw some parallel line. These are the two parallel lines we have drawn. This is point 2 comma 4. This line is parallel to x axis, so we'll say L1. And this line is parallel to y axis, so L2. So for equation L1, we see that y is having a parallel constant value. It's parallel to x axis and value of y is always 4. So for line L1, the equation is y is equal to 4. If you see, this distance is always 4. Similarly for line L2, this line L2, we see this line L2, we see that this line is parallel to y-axis. So this is, equation is x equal to k, k form, and here we know that k is equal to 2 because this point 2 is part of this line. So x equal to 2 is the equation of this line. So we have formed the equation of both the lines and the equation is y is equal to 4 and x is equal to 2. We can also <coughs> very simple what we have done. We have drawn the xy coordinates. We have plotted the point 2, 2 comma 4 and then we drew the line parallel to x axis and parallel to y axis and we formed the equation y is equal to 4 and x is equal to 2. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to Watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.